Good morning. I'm at a different place this morning than what I usually am instead of being at my desk. Still got my coffee though. Um, but I'm here with a friend of mine. Glenn, Ma Glenn Maddox has been a friend of mine for a very long time. Um, we've been through a lot of different stuff together, but um, we're both at a conference. It's called the Baptist General Association of Virginia Conference um, in Hampton Roads. We're at the convention center here. And um, it, some of you might not even know that I'm out of town. So I'll let you know I am. Um, but also want to let you know that what we're doing here is also what we try to do at Woodland, and that's being a part of the body of Christ. And we connect not only with the people in Nelson County, but I have opportunity to connect particularly with pastors and people from churches all across Virginia, and that carries over to the United States and beyond. And there's a lot more I could talk about that, about being a body of Christ and kingdom work. But I just want to have a quick moment. Glenn was talking to me yesterday about some things that are going on that we're a part of because we're connected to BGAV. So, Glenn, would you just tell them what you told me in maybe 60 yeah. seconds or so? Yeah, so our, our, one of my primary responsibilities is disaster response uh, for Virginia Baptists. And a lot of times that has meant Virginia Baptist churches and volunteers responding locally or, or all going en masse to an area. Uh, to serve after a disaster. Well, when Ian struck, uh, Virginia Baptist disaster response wasn't able to respond right away because we were in the path of the storm and, and Virginia emergency management wanted us to be ready to respond here. When that response didn't materialize, uh, the, the response in Florida was already ongoing. But we connected with the church uh, through Fresh Expressions Network, uh, who was really connected in their community but wanted to do more specifically around disaster response. Uh, and we have been able to go down there and partner with them. Uh, and we've set up a, a disaster response site uh, that they are running and we are supporting. So instead of sending tons and tons of volunteers like we, we might have in, in previous storms or we might do more locally, uh, we're actually helping them to become responders so that they can, they can respond locally and train their volunteers to serve. Uh, and then when the next storm comes and we're all serving somewhere else, we'll serve alongside one another uh, as, as impact disaster response serving together. Well, that's pretty awesome. And I, I just wonder if you might say in a nutshell, if there are some people watching this that might want to be hands-on, might want to be involved somewhere down the road and didn't even know that we as Virginia Baptists did this type of thing, what way might they be able to get involved? Uh, well, reaching out to us is, is one of the best ways we can provide training to, to individual churches or more regionally. Um, if you go to impactmissionsmovement.org, you can find where you can uh, volunteer as a, as a disaster response volunteer. There's some training online, and then we can do more training um, over time awesome. uh, together. Yeah. Well, thanks, Glenn. Absolutely. I appreciate it. Always good to see you. Good to see you. Y'all have a great day.